So for today's video, we are digging deep into the Keeping Goals archives, all the way back to 2018, when I challenged PSG superstar Ashraf Hakimi to a shooting challenge, 1v1, on an artificial turf in Madrid. Here's what happened. So, as a little bit of context, at this point in time, I was playing for Fuenlabrada in the third tier of Spanish football. Ashraf was just breaking into the Real Madrid first team. I'd just finished an extra goalkeeper session, he was just finishing an extra fitness session, and we decided to link up at the end and do a little bit of shooting. Both looking a little bit younger than we do right now, but what an experience to be able to train with a guy who is now competing at the very, very top level of world football. And facing his shots, I could see why he was one of the highest rated young players in the world at that point, and why, since, he's had over 100 million euros worth of transfer fees. The way that he could strike a ball with both feet, the accuracy, the power, was just a joke. Shots that I initially thought were going into the top corner, he can make them dip at the last minute and beat me and make me look completely foolish. He could stand you still because he had no back lift when he was shooting. But I like to think of Helmone a little bit. Came up with some big saves, but some unreal finishes in there as well with both feet. If you'd like to see more of my time in Spain, then go back and watch series one of Keeping Goals. But this was definitely a highlight. Top player, really nice guy, and such a privilege to be able to do a session with him as well. But that's not a bad save to finish on. Get in there. At this point, I was rather optimistically saying that he could use the GoPro footage if he wanted to, but I don't think he was that bothered. I like to think that this session had a pivotal role in his future moves to Dortmund, Inter Milan, and now PSG, but I'm not sure it did. Maybe one day we'll have another session together and maybe even face each other on the pitch, who knows. But yeah, cool experience. Yeah.